Are you alone for the journey or are you alone for the ride? A lot of us in our life right now are in a crossroad of trying to figure out, are we on the journey to live for Christ or are we just riding the wave? A lot of people that we see nowadays are riding the wave of the Christian hype and they're not really in tune to doing things according to God's will. But the Bible says it's not his will that any man shall perish, but that all men should come to repentance. And repentance is turning away from your ways and doing something that's according to God's will. And that requires you to be a part of a journey. Because in God's journey and in, in God's will for us in our lives, he wants us to change the way we think, to change the way we talk, change the way we even interact with others. Because that is truly where Christ is going to work. Let this life be within you. Let his light be within you. And you will start to see the fruits of the spirit manifested. So a lot of us are being deceived right now and we don't know honestly what direction we're going because we truly aren't following Christ for his will. We're only following it for our personal gain. And to, to live with Christ is to, to lose. You must lose everything you have to suffer with him. Peace.